show. Well, as you can see, I love watching Cooking with Tittle, and I'm so glad you love watching, too, because we've got a new email address. That's right. It's Tittle in the middle at live, L-I-V-E dot com. So I do hope you will email your Tittle. I've got some great green things going on for this year and some healthy treats. Bon appetit. Let's eat each and every Thursday at 7 p.m. and Fridays at 2 p.m. right here on Channel 19. And now, back to the show. Hey. <laughs> in the middle. Want to have some fun? Welcome to the LaDonna Tittle TV radio show. It's summer in the city with more from war in Hyde Park and also those deviled eggs, my favorite summertime treat and more festivals from Millennium Park and the 59th Street Harbor. You're cooking with Tittle and summer in the city. Bon appetit. Let's eat. Hey, welcome to the show. It is summertime and we're living. Well, it ain't easy, but we're living. And we're living good and we're eating good. And of course, as I promised you, we're eating green. I've got some great summertime snacks and one of my all-time favorites today, deviled eggs. Tittle's gourmet deviled eggs. Right now, we've been enjoying some of the summer concert series, that's right, going on around town. And one of my most memorable ones will be War in Hyde Park. Here's more of War. You're cooking with Tittle. Bon appetit. Let's eat and enjoy. Summertime treats. You know, the one good thing that I love about kale is that people think it's just for decorating your tray, but kale has got so much iron, vitamin C, and it's just an all around good vegetable. Now, you can eat kale raw if you want to, but I like to put a little heat on kale. As a matter of fact, I cook it just like I do greens. So I would say maybe about an hour, hour and a half, and you've got some great kale. And I tell you, it reminds me a little bit of Kalaloo. We've got to do Kalaloo one day. Ooh, it's a Jamaican treat. It's an island treat. It's a Caribbean treat. But it's very healthy and it's green too. So stop decorating your trays with kale and take a bite. <laughs> hey, you're cooking with Tittle. Bon appetit, let's eat. Let's enjoy some more summertime treats. Mmm, good. Oh, it's so green. Now this bowl right here is full of nutrition and it is my perfect summertime treat suggestion. We've got our kale, we've got our green apples, you know, God made them little green apples. And we've got some clementines. I used to call these little nectarines. <laughs> but I guess they're not little nectarines, they're clementines. They're little oranges that, my goodness, you peel them and because I can't do orange juice and it makes me thoroughly break out, this I can eat without feeling no pain because I love me a good orange. Little Clementine. Mm. Good summertime snacks. And of course I also have my avocado because it goes with things and I'm gonna show you uh, another kind of good wrap for nutrition, 
for keeping the weight down and it feels so good. So here we've got the egg which came second because the chicken came first and we're doing my famous gourmet deviled eggs. So once we've got our eggs cooled after boiling and don't forget put a little salt in that water it makes them boil a little faster and the shells come out almost whole when you deshell the egg, okay? So we're gonna take our eggs, we're gonna split them very nicely right in half because you're going to fill the deviled egg with uh, the yolk that you're going to gently remove. Oops, <laughs> well, you know how that happens. It's an egg, okay, it popped out. <laughs> and you're gonna make sure you pop those in and your eggs are going to sit like so on the plate. So you just gently slice them right in half and be as evenly as you can. I guess you could just pop them out <laughs> instead of scooping them out. But you really wanna be careful that you don't break the fragile egg shell itself. So you want your egg to look whole and of course that's a little raggedy looking but you know you're bound to get it perfect if you keep on trying right right so nice and half goes the egg and we're just gonna scoop it out into the bowl there now that that looks pretty good doesn't it I have to redeem myself here <laughs> And why not? Eggs are usually gentle, whether the mother is carrying them or once they get out of the shell. Is that right or what? But they are meant for eating and they are healthy for you, full of protein. So you see, you get this kind of nice yolk when you make sure that your eggs are really boiled good. So that's why I boil the eggs for 25 to 30 minutes and it works for me. Now that we've got our yolks in the bowl we are ready to do some smashing and some mixing so i'm just gonna just smash these eggs up real nice and see this is what happens when you get a nice done egg yolk you don't have nothing drippy you don't have nothing half cooked because this will spoil your your eggs when they so when they're nice and done, they look good and they look like that. Mm -hmm. Looking pretty good there, those yolks. So we'll continue to smash them up. Make them nice and smooth. And you know what, if, you're, if your eggs are not um, like creamy and smooth and have that creamy texture, you can always um, feel good about them because you know they have a little texture in your mouth doesn't hurt so you can do them really creamy or you can do them kind of chunky but don't forget they have to fit inside this little hole <laughs> right there okay all right so now that we've got that done we're going to take some veginase we're gonna whoop that right in there let's get a better spatula here. So Veginase is not a non-dairy, egg-free, no cholesterol, and you can even get this gluten-free. So for all my veggies, I know you are loving this. I absolutely love it and it tastes good. Then I do have to cheat with a little Miracle Whip. <laughs> That's not even mayonnaise in my book, okay? okay so then we're going to put our Miracle Whip in there, just a little bit. So it's kind of a half and half thing, you know, half veggie. Who is that said they apologized and said it was a Paul? <laughs> Not a jazz. I think that was Charlie Cha-Ching Cha-Ching Lee. <laughs> Boy, that guy is really doing. Anyway, so now I want some sweet relish in there. That's right, relish. You don't have to cut up them pickles anymore, Virginia, okay? Then I found a little corn relish, which is also going to give me a nice sweet flavor. Put that in there. And with that, I'm going to add a little garlic. 
just a little bit because I don't want it chunky. I thought I'd do myself a favor and get some in the tube. And then I'm going to add a little bit of basil. Just a pinch. And now we're going to do what I love to do. Mix it up and see what we've got. So I got all the, oops, kind of wild mix in there. So I've got, I should say we're going to fold this in. We're going to make it very creamy. And you know, if you wanted to add some more yolks, you certainly can. So that's your Tittles Gourmet. Oh, and you know, you're gonna put these in the refrigerator so it'll set for a little while and then you're gonna serve them up and they're gonna be so good. Oh, I tell you. So now that I've got all of that mixed, how about I give it a taste? My goodness. I think they're gonna really like these devil eggs. Oh yeah. Yeah. I think these devil eggs are gonna be real good. <laughs> so good I cracked the spoon. <laughs> Hey, we're having summertime fun here. What can I say? We're going to scoop our devil eggs up, and we've got more concert fun. You're cooking with Tittle. Bon appetit. Let's eat. <laughs> Spoon. <laughs> Well, as you can see, I love watching Cooking with Tittle, and I'm so glad you love watching, too, because we've got a new email address. That's right. It's Tittle in the middle at live, L-I-V-E dot com. So I do hope you will email your Tittle. I've got some great green things going on for this year and some healthy treats. Bon appetit. Let's eat each and every Thursday at 7 p.m. and Fridays at 2 p.m. right here on Channel 19. And now, back to the show. Hey.